next one we have mover scum. I'm sure that many of you are familiar with the phenomenon of Israeli guys working in the moving industry in the US. Our next speaker, Itzik, knows everything about it from personal experience. But working in traditional ways was not enough for him. The moving industry is anticipating for a solution that Itzik is offering, and Itzik has some interesting stories to tell you, but we will save it after this speech. Please welcome him on stage. Good morning, everybody. This is how the work day of my life looked like back in 2014. Making 400 to 700 calls a day, 200 to 300 emails a day, 16 to 20 hours of work a day, endless multiple task force that I need to do double, and I had to take one red pill, one blue pill every day to overcome the headache that I got. So the problem that uh, I and other dispatchers in the moving industry had was to release long distance shipments and load long distance trucks to max capacity. The solution that I came up with is an online platform to match available loads to available trucks and vice versa. The magic that I have is my phone, my mobile phone. In 2014, I decided to disrupt my industry and gather all the moving companies and all the connections that I knew into one group chat, a simple group chat that slowly with the time grew to be 1,000 moving companies, representing about 12% of the US market, making about $25 million a year a month through the system. So I'm Itzik David, founder and CEO. I got 17 years experience in the moving industry. I did everything from a basic worker to a company co-owner, including all well, in the moving industry. What we do? Connecting the moving community together. How we doing it? On platform for loads and transportation. The, the, the system has to be user friendly, so the process is simple. Upload truck, search for ship, system show result, choose shipment, book shipment. The shippers, upload shipment, search for truck, system shows result, choose carrier, book carrier. Business model is 5% commission per transaction. Go to First 1,000 moving company in our chat group, then 3,500 members of the USA Movers Association, and then the rest of the market. The US industry market is $19 billion market with approximately 8,000 moving companies and a growth rate of 3.75% per year. Compared to the US freight industry, which is not moving, there are a few platforms like that, truck stop, load board. However, in the moving industry, there is no similar platform as of right now. In Europe, there is a network called Tri Global. They have a load exchange. Our roadmap to success. By first quarter 2019, moving companies, then first quarter 2020 we expect to finalize the web and mobile app development and second quarter 2020 we will complete the pilot with 150 or 200 moving companies which I've already spoke to them and ready for a pilot and first quarter 2020 we expect to have 300 users on a working platform. Use of funds, we estimated to invest 60% in development, 30% sales, 10% in marketing. The exact numbers, I don't know yet. If we're gonna know it in the near future, still working on it. Thank you. So very inspiring. Um, so just to make sure, we're going to organize all the small movers in order to get scale and optimization? Yes, in the beginning, in, uh, the first uh, approach is we only to the 50% of the market, which is the small moving companies. And I have 
almost 10, 12 percent of them already that I know. So yeah, they're the initial market. And they're based in a specific area because there's so many. All, of, all over the state, all over USA, okay. United States. So my question is, yeah. to get uh, a maximum utilization and optimization, you need so many conditions to be set. Uh, are you aware of all those problems in order to get, uh, to get them to, to be more uh, uh, utilized? Uh, you need them to be very close to each other. You need the, the cargo to be similar. You have many challenges. Okay, I will explain it. Basically, the moving industry niche, it's a, it's a niche. Everybody has the same license, everybody has the same equipment, everybody has the same cargo. So there is no different cargos. So everybody is doing the same. The only thing that they need to enter the system, what loads they have to send out, and the carrier need to put where the truck's going from, from to, and the system will match it automatically. They just need to put where they go from and go into. So there's not too many indicators like in different freight or different equipment. I just wanted to make sure I understand the pain. Is there really a problem in that market? Or maybe I missed this slide, but what's the real need for uh, your idea? I understood the idea, I liked it, but I just want to make sure it Meet, uh, and meet, yeah. Okay, well, basically, I'm building this platform for me. <laughs> so, we speak about this problem all the time, every day. Uh, in the chat group, for example, I did the differences between them. So, you, you don't know 100% the people that you're working with. You need to check the companies that you work with. And in my system, I'm building a rating system for every user. So, everybody's going to be rated by their experience, and uh, of course, a few days ago, a few days ago, it took me two or three days to load the truck. If I had my system up and running, I would just put where my truck is going from, where it's going to, and I could do it in a matter of minutes, or maybe less. And this software, software doesn't exist? I mean, this is not something... That... For the moving niche, no. There is in the freight industry, which is $800 billion market, that they don't look like a 20 billion dollar market but in the in the freight market there is in the moving not yet they're not combined i built the biggest community the 1000 moving company together like, this is the biggest community in the in this industry so i want to make sure that i understand do you, do you have a consumer facing side to your uh, solution i don't have i don't have right now in the far future i do plan to so the, so this is for movers that want to B2B. hire other movers to exactly. offload some of their work. Yes, exactly. Some of their customers. In the far future, after this system will be up and running, I'm going to have the database of all the moving companies which are going to rate themselves. And then I can open a, a second side to be B2C. And I'm going to use those ratings that the moving companies rate each other to sell it for the customer. And this so is going to be a big leap. So, have you considered to skip the first phase and go and be the Uber of moving? Uh, no, I'm, I'm doing what I'm strong at. I'm doing what that I have a blue ocean, you know? so, and I have all my connections already, you know, waiting for me, coming up with my solution. So, I'm starting with this, and I need this. I need the database. I need to get the market together with all the rating, all the information all the traction, and then I can come up with the B2C platform. And do you currently live in the US? No. So I'm working from Israel. Yeah. So the thousand movers are in the US, Yeah. you're here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So I just want to say that your story is really inspiring. Uh, we love stories like this when you're coming from the industry, you're growing within the pain point and then you're able to build something to actually address. So mm -hmm. I love your story. Okay. Um, so let me just, as his point, and basically, so you don't have a consumer facing, meaning you don't right now have an answer to the demand. You have a supply, but you don't really have... No, I mean, so, so maybe I misunderstood. So, maybe, so I'd love to understand that better. This is a B2B solution, okay? 
one company has a customer that they need to ship from long distance place like New York to California, and they don't want to send their truck right now because the truck is not full. So they're gathering their loads together. And there is another moving company that has a truck that leaves in tomorrow from New York to California. So they take in the customer that has that is in the other company's place with other moving companies, combining them together to one truck, and they hit the road. So it's B2B. So they need they need the, the, to fill up their truck, the carriers, and the shippers, which is another moving company basically, they have a lot of customers that they need to ship across the state. And the transaction itself occurs over your platform? So say like the company, moving company A wants to pay moving company B for the actual in the In the new platform, yes. In the chat group right now, it's not like this. They just talk to each other. They need to scroll and to see you know, who's available and where, and they need to go through like 100, 200, 300 messages a day. But in this platform, you're just gonna put where you're going and, and it's gonna be instant. Impressive story. Thanks. Like, any geographic uh, focus for the first launch? USA. US market. USA, I all got all it. All <laughs> well, it's a long distance uh, platform, so it has to be all over the state. Great. Yes.